माई चैनल जस्ट गो विद अमरीन बैक विथ अनादर एपिसोड ऑन एल्कोहॉल आई बीन गेटिंग सो मेनी क्वेश्चन अबाउट एल्कोहॉल एंड एल्कोहॉल लॉज एंड लाइसेंसिंग एंड ऑल दैट कैन स्टाफ इन दुबई अपेरेंटली नॉट अलॉट ऑफ पीपल नो अबाउट इट सो आई थॉट वाई नॉट जस्ट डू एन एक्चुअल लाइक अ प्रॉपर सेगमेंट ऑन एल्कोहॉल एंड इट्स लॉज and also where you can find uh, affordable alcohol to drink within dubai all of that kind of stuff but before we move forward i would like to request please go ahead and subscribe to my channel if you like my vlogs if you want to support me it's free just need to press subscribe please all right that's my request a few weeks ago i did a vlog about alcohol shopping in uae not particularly in dubai just uae so there is an emirate called ras al khaima where we went to show how affordable the alcohol prices are over there but a lot of people have come back to me uh, with a certain question which i would like to clarify that it is not legal to carry alcohol bottles from ras al khaima to dubai okay however having said that there are lots of places within dubai where you can not just purchase alcohol but also drink alcohol at very affordable prices and i'm going to tell you all about that today we are on our way to our first bar slash pub slash restaurant it's everything all in one it's one of my favorite places that i go to um but before we move forward i really want to talk about some of the laws uh and there are about four or five of them which are absolutely set in stone super important and if you are coming to dubai as a tourist it's important that you know what these laws are because if you don't you could really get into some serious trouble if you end up breaking these laws you could end up being fined or get arrested or even deported sent back to your country so it's best that you follow these laws they are not very heavy difficult to follow laws but these are important laws that you should know one of the most important and basic law is that you should be above 21 to have alcohol anywhere more alcohol laws will continue but we are here on our first stop all right so we've come to our first bar well actually it's a sports bar but it's also a restaurant it's my favorite place and it's so close to our house it's located in dubai sports city and it's called kickers and we are actually coming here during the happy hours the happy hours are from 3 pm to 7 pm so right now it's 5 Let's go. Let's see if we can talk to the manager if he's there. Okay, so unfortunately the manager wasn't there, so we couldn't talk to him. And I got a chance to talk to the bartender asking him about the happy hours in um Kickers. So Uh, Kickers has happy hours from 3 p.m. to 7 p.m. and uh, their happy hours the deal they run is about 33% off discount on most of their alcohol uh, they have spirits they have house wines red and white and they have uh, draught beers which is foster amstel stella and a few others but what they've recently changed is uh, amstel foster and stella they are running like full day happy hours on these three beers so it's 33% discount on these three beers all day so now we are headed to another spot it's called belgium beer cafe uh, and we're headed there right now let's see if we get to talk to anyone there all right so continuing about the alcohol laws in uae so the second law that i would like to talk about is the drinking and driving uh, policy they have a zero tolerance policy basically 0% alcohol zero tolerance for drinking and driving in dubai so basically if you are uh, caught caught for it drinking and driving um which is most likely because there there are regular checks that happen in dubai is very random so if you are caught drinking and driving you will be deported or arrested or one of those things or both those things immediately i cannot stress enough on the fact please please never think about drinking and driving if you are going to a party if you know there's alcohol take a drive take a friend to drive you around or take a kareem uber taxi whatever but don't drink and drive another important thing that you should know is that you are not allowed to drink in public places in the sense you cannot walk out uh, on the streets with a bottle of beer in your hand or you cannot think about having a bottle of wine and glass 
you know, uh, by the beach. Sorry, not happening. So we didn't get to film much. I am also getting to uh, realize this is more challenging than I had imagined. <laughs> um, can't film too much in the bars. So their happy hours are from uh, 4 p.m. to 8 p.m. every day, except on Thursdays, it is from 2 p.m. to 8 p.m. Their beers are priced between 8 and 14 dollars, and their spirits and wines and other whiskies are priced between 14 and 18 dollars. This is their normal pricing. This is not happy hour pricing. The happy hour deal is 50% off, 50% discount on, um, on their beers, on their drought beers and uh, house wines which is red, white, rosé and sparkling and also a few uh, house spirits. Now moving forward, going to the third stop, we are going all the way to the center of the city, the heart of Dubai, Bar Dubai and the uh, bar we are heading to is a rooftop bar and it's uh, located inside the Royal Ascot Hotel in Bar Dubai. So let's go. Let me catch your name. What's your name again? My name is Pulkit. Pulkit? Pulkit, yes. Pulkit, alright. So I just want to know about your happy hours. What What do you offer in your happy hours? Happy hours, uh, see that is the timing that we make for the early crowd to get in. Right. So that is the time like 4 to 9 that we have a happy hours four every day. 4 to 9. Okay. So 4 to 9 we do 1 plus 1, 1 on 1. Okay. So that will be inclusive of your all regular drinks that so having followed by beer, whiskey, vodka, gin, tequila, rum. So this is all alcoholic beverages, you will get one on one. All alcohol all or alcohol, selected? No, that will be selected regular drinks. Regular drinks means that is a comes in whiskey, it's like a regular coming in like red label, valentines, not the premium ones, not black label, not Jack Daniel, not okay. Shivers. Okay. Okay, so that is the regular, regular drinks. I see. Yeah, so we are doing only with a bottle beer, okay. whiskey, vodka, gin, tequila, rum. So everyone has different brands. But there no wine, I heard there. no wine. No, there is no wine. No wine? No wine. Okay, wine is full price. Yes. Okay, so that was about alcohol. Yeah. What about your food? Food, we do have all all cuisines that we have, multi cuisine we have, like having an Indian, continental, Chinese, Arabic, so everything we have in our menu. Okay, awesome. Yeah. Do you have any discounts on food? Discounts on food as such, like Zomato is there, so whosoever having a Zomato, they are getting the straight 25% flat discount. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for talking to us. Thank you so much. So continuing the alcohol laws in Dubai, uh, you need to have a permit or a license to purchase alcohol in Dubai. There are two uh, wine cellars from where you can purchase alcohol. One is African and Eastern and the other one is MMI. These are, the, these are the two wine cellars in Dubai that you can purchase alcohol from and these are the two places you can also go and apply for this license, this alcohol permit that I'm talking about. The alcohol permit costs 270 dirhams, however the tourists don't need to worry about that. All they have to do is take their original passport with the tourist visa on it and the wine sellers will know you're a tourist and you will be permitted to purchase alcohol without any hassle. As long as you are above 21 and a non-Muslim, you can purchase alcohol in Dubai. Now I haven't talked about ladies nights but ladies nights is another sort of a deal just for women. If you're a group of women or you are just a couple of friends, girls, you go and you want to have some alcohol, there are some absolutely insane deals for women. I mean to the extent that there is unlimited alcohol, unlimited house wines. Uh, for like four hours some places they restrict like three glasses or four glasses or some or just cocktails and things like that but there are places that give you like four hours of unlimited drinks it's insane <laughs> like it's mind-blowing and so not fair to the men <laughs> uh, today's a Thursday so I'm going there right now and this place has ladies night tonight so I'm gonna get there and see what their deal is but basically this is what goes on in Dubai. This is the best way if you want to drink in Dubai and not pay a bomb. This is these are the deals that you have to go for. Happy hours, ladies nights. Very few places have men's nights but I, I really don't come across many. So let's carry on. This is uh, our last and final destination. Okay. <laughs>
Hi. Hi. Uh, what's your name? Anish. Anish. Hi, Anish. So, uh, what's the name of the bar? Uh, uh, name of the bar is a High Five. High Five. Yes. Awesome. And this is located in Dubai Media City. Dubai Media City, absolutely right. In the Holiday Inn. In Holiday Inn. Yes. Excellent. I believe you have happy hours as well. Yes, we have. All right. So, can you tell me a little about happy hours? What are the timing? Happy the hours every day. We have 12 noon to until 8 p.m. 12 noon to 8 p.m. every day. Every day. Yes. Um, you have wines, whiskeys, beers. Yes, house spirits, wine, and uh, uh, beer also. Beer, draft beer also is including with that. And how much is this? Beer for? Uh, for example, like Henneken and Amsterdam, like we are giving only 35 dirhams for that happy hour. Yes. Is that the lowest starting price of alcohol in happy hours? No, we have another one. For example, red wine, white wine, and spirits, this all starting at uh, 25 dirhams only for that. White wine, red wine starts from 25, 25 dirhams. Yes. Excellent. Excellent. And I believe you have ladies' night on a weekend. Yes, ladies night. Which indeed. is very unique. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> so what is the deal with ladies night? For example, uh, Thursday, every Thursday night we okay. have ladies night. It's for the only 99 dirhams. Okay. It's uh, unlimited drinks. Oh. We have selected beverage list there. Yeah. Okay. From that, you, you can order whatever you like. Okay. Just three hours, you will get unlimited drinks. And you can choose one main courses from the main uh, menu also. Okay. That's okay. Thank you, Anish. That is all I wanted to know. Great. Thank, Thank you, you so, so much. much. Have this. You too. There's only one last thing that I wanted to tell you is that UAE is known to be a Muslim country and it is deeply rooted in Islamic values. However, it is also known to be tolerant to other religion, cultures, customs and everything. So hence alcohol is allowed but there are some protocols that you need to follow. There are some rules and laws that you need to abide if you want to you know, go ahead and you know, drink and have fun. Just don't drive after drinking and drink responsibly. Uh, of course, there's one more thing. Don't drink and create a scene on the streets or anywhere actually. Violence of any kind is, is just a big no. The only emirate that does not allow alcohol at all, like zilch, not allowed, like not at all, like that is Sharjah. Sharjah is one of the seven emirates in UAE that does not allow alcohol at all. Hey guys, so this is me signing off. If you like this vlog, please give me a big fat thumbs up. Do leave me your comments in the comment section below. Tell me what you thought about this vlog. If you have any questions, please go ahead and ask me. I will answer them right away. And do subscribe to my channel. It will show me a great support and hit that bell icon so that you don't miss any of my upcoming vlogs. Take care guys, stay healthy, stay safe, cheers, bye! Shhh! Arey baba, it's goal goal, left jao ge, right jao ge, a jai ga. Sare raste, god ko jate. Kizhe ni? Hey Millennium! Hey, you can just park here, dunia ki parking hai. Why are you struggling so much? Hey, there's a car right behind you. Where the hell are you going to park?